Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be looking at decentralized cloud computational cryptocurrency projects and why I believe that this is a narrative that will make millionaires. I really believe that decentralized cloud computation has very strong justification on the blockchain and this is a narrative that is sitting at a total market cap of $29 billion. That just goes to show you how early we are with this narrative. There are several reasons why I believe decentralized cloud computation is very good on the blockchain. And there's an interesting article that I'm going to share in the links down below. And it goes on to explain why decentralized cloud computing and the blockchain is very useful and is going to be a revolutionary step for people all around the world. So you can see here that the key difference between cloud computing and blockchain is that cloud computing relies solely on centralized servers while the blockchain utilizes a decentralized network. Another significant distinction between the two technologies is that cloud computing focuses on storing and accessing data while the blockchain facilitates digital transaction. So in other words, cloud computing focuses more on transmitting information, whereas the blockchain emphasizes the exchange of value. That potential, that economic incentive to give people the additional option of making money makes this an economic powerhouse in my opinion. There are many aspects to decentralized cloud computing like um, platform as a service, software as a service, infrastructure as a service, and there are many projects that tap into different aspects of this. One of the most recent hype in crypto is decentralized physical infrastructure network DPIN and it all falls under decentralized cloud computing. So the benefits of blockchain um, on cloud computing include increased security and privacy, enhanced cloud backup solution, new opportunities for cloud services, and I've mentioned some others on my channel before, including more accessibility by breaking down borders, as well as the potential to earn while um, renting this. There's also the advantage of not having to buy expensive um, GPU rendering devices and so on. So there's massive potential with decentralized cloud computing. I really believe that this is a, a narrative that will do very well and it's sitting at just 29. The total market cap is just $29 um, billion. And I think, you know, there are many projects that are quite undervalued within this narrative. And in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing five of such projects. The first project on my list today is Akash Network. This should come as no surprise to you because I've been covering Akash Network since it was sitting at around $300 million in market cap. Akash Network has a lot going for it. You know, all of the projects in my video today, they are, they are packed with utility, you know, they have a lot of features and I believe they are really interesting projects. So, Akash Network is sitting at $779 million with over 58% in circulation. Now, like I said, there's a lot going for um, decentralized cloud computing. You know, it's, it has a lot of potential. It has good justification on the blockchain. And all of the projects in today's video are feature packed. So how are we going to be able to pick the winners, you know, from the losers? How are we going to be able to pick the projects that are worth investing in? Well, it's really simple, actually. To beat the competition, they have to have First of all, unique selling points. Then you have to check out the team and the tokenomics. These three things at once are, are what will determine the projects that will go on to do 5, 10, 50, even 100x for you in the bull run. Like, like I said, you know, all of the projects today, they are feature packs, they, are, they have good utility, but we have to be able to pick out these three points to be able to determine whether or not these projects are worth investing in. So moving forward, you know, all of the projects will be saying they have this, they are good, they are good um, deep in projects, they are good decentralized cloud computing projects, but are they worth investing in? And these are the things that will, um, these are the things that will help us determine whether they are worth investing in or not. So. As for our cash network, the unique selling point has to be with the Cosmos ecosystem and the amount of time that they have built. A cash network is a really fleshed out decentralized cloud computing crypto project. They've had time to build. They have different products already. And its Cosmos SDK is a very unique selling point, allowing um, different blockchains to be able to take advantage of, of that interoperability. So this is a premier, like I said, they've had time to flesh out this um, narrative. It's the world's premier 
decentralized um, computing marketplace infrastructure is part of future infrastructure as a code um, Kubernetes powered persistent storage Akash offers limitless storage safeguarding data even post restart an ideal feature for data intensive app I think that's also an, an interesting feature and it's not limited to just Akash but you know like I said this is a premier crypto project and I think Akash can go much higher you know if you compare it to projects like RNDR which is in the billions Akash is still very undervalued you know this is a project that can easily reach five billion dollars in market cap so that's about a 7x from where we are sitting right now I think Akash network is very good so um you know its unique selling point is there now the next thing we have to look at is um the um the tokenomics and the team and Akash network is also really good when it comes to that you know this project is a no-brainer in my opinion if you look at the tokens the Akash token is the native utility token for um the platform you the primary means for governing securing the blockchain incentivizing participants and so on you know when it comes to decentralized cloud computing why i'm super bullish on this um, narrative is because you just need to buy the tokens to be able to use the platform for the services they offer using the tokens give you so much more um value and benefits that it makes sense to you know hold the tokens hoping that the value goes up so with akash network you know these are the um utilities for the token value exchange and incentivization and governance and i really really like the tokenomics over 58 percent in circulation the inflation rate happens approximately every 3.7 years and the monthly inflation is approximately um 4.5 percent 54 percent annualized apr at genesis so there isn't any worry about this project um you know the inflation and causing it to dump on people and you know i really like akash is one of the best decentralized cloud computing projects that will do very well in this bull run the next project is one that i've received a lot of requests to cover and that's claw ai now i took a look at this project and it's also a really good one its unique selling point has to be in the proof of holding um, consensus mechanism, which is very unique. You know, it's not too common. Simply by holding the tokens, you can um, earn rewards and there are a lot of benefits that you can accrue from this project. And that's quite um, unique. So this one is a low cap sitting at $50 million, approximately $50 million in market cap. On their website, you see this also has a lot of features, um, distributed supercomputer that fits your needs, accessing GPU power, you know, with the blockchain and all of that, AI training, mining, movie reader. So what sets this project apart from the others? Well, it has very competitive fees. It's simple to use. I've checked it out. And there's a lot of incentive to actually use um, Claw AI. They're active over 14,000 video cards and 3,000 machines um, being used. So this is a project that has a good um, activity. It has a good community behind it. And the main challenge I found with it was there wasn't not really much information on its tokenomics. The closest I found to its tokenomics is right here. Um, limited supply with a maximum cap of 1.3 billion coins set to be fully mined in 20 years. Scarcity is ensured and the tokenomics ensures that the distribution with 50% of each block goes to miners with 40% to hosters and 10% um, to the team. So there's incentive to hold the tokens and the proof of holding is also a unique thing about this project so claw ai is a good one i like the activity behind it i like um yeah i like i said i tried to check out the tokenomics but it was difficult but other than that there's a lot more going for this project and i think it has a lot of potential you can see here the marketplace you know is active um there are people buying it and they have attractive prices lots of option and you pay with crypto so yeah it's an active project and I like what they are doing so this is another one that i think has a lot of long-term potential when it comes to this narrative reaching 300 million dollars and above in market cap is very possible possible for this project and i think that's an easy 10x and above for the bull run next is one that i've been covering since it was around four million dollars in market cap and that's um nuco cloud so nuco cloud you know if you've watched my videos covering it i've spoken about how it's one of the few regulatory compliance cryptos and you know has the first mover advantage in Germany when it comes to um, that. This is a project with 
decent tokenomics and yeah over six to four percent in circulation just 25 million dollars in market cap so um you know if you would like to get in early on good projects that i cover on my channel be sure to subscribe um and like the video while you're at it so i think nuko cloud is another good one it's quite unique um and its unique selling point, like I said earlier, is that it's the first regulatory compliance crypto in Germany. So they have that first mover advantage. And yeah, you know, they're not afraid to talk about the competition. It has a lot of features like many other of the um, decentralized cloud computing projects. And there's a lot more going for it. You can see it in comparison with other crypto projects and um, Web2 projects as well. For Amazon Web Services, you know, expensive Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud. Let's compare it with the crypto projects. The render RDR token is doing just like um, Nuco Cloud. But when it gets to the EU GDPR compliance, yeah, that's a no for the RNDR token. That's a no for IXEC. That's a no for Akash. That's a no for Golem and a no for ICP, but a yes for Nuco Cloud. Eligible in Germany is a yes for Nuco Cloud as well and a no for all the rest. So a very unique project that I've been covering for a very long time and, you know, I like that about it. But I will take some points away from Nuco Cloud because there's nothing I can find about the team. And, you know, it's still a great project, but... The only thing that they say about the team, if you scroll down um, over here, is just, yeah, first of all, experience and knowledge. Um, people behind our projects are well-known experts recognized by delivering best cloud computing solutions. So the team is out there. They, they claim that they are great, but it would be nice for them to make it easily accessible. But other than that, you know, the tokenomics of Nuco Clouds are also good. They are open and accessible. Over 50% in circulation. As at the time of launch, around 50% um, launch. The company has reserved and locked um, 12 points. 5 million close to 25 percent and you know we can see the staking development so i'm not worried about this project in terms of um inflation i like that there's already 64 percent in circulation now and there are incentives to use the token 20 percent discounts for payments in nuco cloud when customers pay for computing power and 70 percent goes to the miner 30 percent returns to nuco cloud so i really like this project i think it's what's accumulating on major dips you know there's the option to draw in more people it has the network effect so by allowing people to pay with fiat is a great deal you know the combination of crypto and fiat would make these projects go really far but the option to buy and save money who doesn't want to save money is also there and that's what will give the, the tokens a lot of value and you know incentive for people to buy and keep holding with the distribution in their tokenomics so nuco cloud is one that is an easy 20 to 50x in the bull run in my opinion the next project on my list today is another one I've gotten a lot of requests to um, cover, and that's OPSEC. Now, um, I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not really a big fan of um, this project because of this um, criteria right here. Now, OPSEC has been gaining a lot of attention recently, and even in my Patreon community, you know, several people were able to get 3x with it and make some money with it. But I took a look at this project and when I look at the unique selling points and the team and the tokenomics, I ended up not really being a big fan of it. So why do I say so? Now, this is a project that on their website, they make a lot of claims. It's full of so many amazing things, you know, like it's feature packs, just like a cash network, like um, Claw AI, like Nuco Cloud. However, when it comes to the unique selling points, uh, yeah, the cloud verse, when it comes to the team, there's not much information I can see about the team and the tokenomics. And yeah, I have a big issue with that because the closest information I could find to the team was um, just this post right here about um, Chris Williams being um, the, C the CBDO of OPSEC. So, I would like to see better information out there about this project and um, the tokenomics as well. You know, it has a buy and sell tax of 5% and the only other information is that it has 100 million tokens, a, a total supply fixed at 100 million tokens. There's no information about the distribution like we can see with Akash Network or um, with Nuco Cloud, just 100 million tokens and a buy and sell tax. So yeah, this is an interesting project. I can see why people like it. 
it's just um it's just so much talk so much promises and not enough information um for people to be able to access it and in the crypto space i, I usually try to be um, careful with projects that do um, things like that so this is a project that is a high risk high reward play it could do very well especially with the hype and um yeah people talking about it the network effects and yeah it could be just pay attention to the fact that a lot of influencers shilling it and talking about it constantly could mean that it's just um relying mainly on hot air and gas but still an interesting project that um solves a lot of the issue with um centralized cloud computing decentralized cloud computing as a whole i think is a great narrative and will do um very well so um upsec has been performing very well you can see the chart here it's been going crazy high and yeah it could still do very well but you just note that you're getting in at a time when a lot of people are talking about it and there's a lot of risk with it so the last project is one of my favorites and that's gamer coin now this is another great decentralized cloud computing um project that has a strong focus on the gaming community it's sitting at 34 million dollars in market cap now i really like this project the unique selling points is there the justification it's got a good team behind it and the tokenomics are also decent we're going to be looking at um that in a moment so you know like many other of the decentralized cloud computing there's a good earning potential it has good justification good community as well a large platform access it on windows linux mac google and ios so accessibility is extremely important and this project also has that in the cards for it. So I like that this project's white paper is well written. There's a lot of information jam packed into this project. You can take a look at it from their website as well. You know, they cover the tokenomics, they cover the team, they cover the market analysis as well. So it was a very interesting read for this project. And, you know, I think it's going to do very well. And we're going to take a quick look at some of um, the things in it. And that's including the fact that this project is, tap is already tapping into a good market you know you can see here um, games and in-game currency include um, from Fortnite, Minecraft, Grand Theft Auto Online, World of Tanks and so on so yeah this is a really this is a project that has a lot of building behind it and another thing about this project that I really like is its business model um, users receive between 93 and a hundred percent of the funds end and the gamer hash fee is zero percent for ASICs hardware and between two to seven percent for desktop um, owners the play to earn potential is also their users earn additional funds through completing tasks through game entertainment so this is tapping into two narratives that i'm super bullish on um decentralized cloud computing and crypto gaming this is a no-brainer for me in my opinion another 20 to 50x for the bull run gamer coin is definitely one that should um, be on your radar so like i said earlier there's a good market analysis they have case studies we're going to be taking a look at the um tokenomics to see how the tokens are distributed um, for this project the total supply of 880 million tokens and 36 was released at launch so that's a good thing you know not too many not too much concern for inflation in the crypto space a project launching with 36 percent is pretty decent in my opinion this project clearly details what they did um, with their funds the proceeds 46 45 percent for the product development 25 percent for marketing you know clearly defined and as for the token allocation 36 percent at launch the team has 15 percent community five percent foundation 14 um ecosystem 12 so a well detailed tokenomics and i think that's very decent i think this project will do very well use this video as a tool check it out and i really think you would see it as a decent project um what accumulating for the bull run that's it for this video a super bullish narrative that i believe will make millionaires in the bull run thank you so much for watching i really hope you've subscribed by now like share comments down below on any other project or topic you'd like to see me cover and i hope to see you next time stay safe and take care